today but today is Tuesday and it's like so beautiful like y'all I love me a good weather I love a good sunshine like it just makes your day makes your life feel two times much better than you know just an original day but um I'm in a good mood I'm feeling blessed and highly favored and you know just a lot of things has taken place recently and you know just trying to get it together but I'm thinking I'm getting it together because I'm putting God first so um I, you know sometimes we slip up when it comes to that we slip up on you know giving God the glory and, and the honor and everything that we do and then things start to happen you know so this time gotta be consistent I have to be consistent because that's the only way I'll make it through the only way that I will get to where I need to be and the only way it can happen right you know it can happen correctly because God is in the mix so that is the plan that is the goal so yes I don't know but my hair is like it's cute but I, I think I want to pull it all up or something because it's like in my face but like the sun is hitting me good I feel good. I feel, I don't know. And you guys, oh my God, my manager is about to have her baby soon. And I sent her like this cute message and she cried, of course. Um, I love her. But yeah, I probably won't go to dinner till probably like five, six o'clock. So I'm just going to sit out here, chill out for a little bit, enjoy the weather, like, you know, enjoy my time and stuff. Enjoy my time and stuff. So yeah. <laughs> eating my lunch before class I just got out my interview y'all that interview was hard like I got nailed with questions but like I don't know I think I did okay I'm not really sure so <sighs> I'm not really sure but I hope I did good my light is not that good but it's something but this is what I'm eating I'm eating rice broccoli and tuna I think this is tuna. Let's see. Yes. Tuna. And then some oranges. And I'm just listening to music. So it feels lovely out here. Really, really good. Um, but yes, you guys, that's about it. I have class at 12 and it's 11:27, So I have to hurry up and finish eating. And then I will catch you guys in a little bit. Bye. I am um, on my way to um, an etiquette dinner. Um, so I'm excited about that. It starts at 5 30, but it told us to come a little bit earlier. It looked like it rained or was going to rain, but um, I don't have my umbrella and my car is like down yonder. So I don't really know exactly. Um, look, he looks so peaceful and is reading his little book. My laptop, um, not my school laptop, but my personal laptop. Um, something, I think something happened to the to the hard drive or something because like when I cut on my laptop, it has a little circle with the dash in the middle, and I don't think that's good. So I took it to Best Buy, and the guy said that um, I can turn it in um, to get like a for them to do like a um what is it called to do a um okay y'all pause let's get into these brows hunty what is it called y'all know what i'm talking about just to see what's wrong with it i forgot the name um so yeah and he's like that's gonna be like a hundred dollars i don't have a hundred dollars and if something is wrong but they was going to be a hundred and fifty dollars to send it out um for more work i guess but i'm not doing all of that um so 
I took it to my school. I took it to IT, and then she tried to reboot it for me. And um, she tried to reboot it for me. And then normally, I guess, when you try to reinstall the, um, the installation and all of that stuff, it normally should pop up, and it didn't pop up. So something's really wrong with it. But what I did was um, I have the new MacBook Pro um, that the school gave me when I first got here. And, you know, they only have, like, they have four of the same... Um, uh, ports on the laptop so they don't have like a USB the SD card and all of that stuff so I just bought an extra um, port thing so that I'll be able to you know edit and all of that stuff okay. here is your name tag and you don't have any allergies nope no allergies so you can go ahead and Thank you. look at the first pick of seats we're still early so yeah. you can go to the bathroom oh, down there okay. Thank you. you're welcome <laughs> Um, at the etiquette at adequate dinner, um, you know, they was trying to teach us, you know, good table manners and stuff like that. And using my phone was not, you know, what I'm saying having my phone out and stuff like that. Even though I wasn't like on my phone to like communicate with others, but to vlog you guys, like that wasn't a good. So I didn't record all of that stuff, but I learned a lot, and um, I learned a lot and. I can't wait to go to a fancy restaurant so I can use these skills. I mean, I guess I can still use it even if I'm not going to a restaurant. But, I mean, going to a fancy restaurant. But um, I would love to so that I can show my skills. So I'm like, yeah, I know where the fork's supposed to go. This is my workout outfit. It's not, like, coordinated or nothing. I just got this Puma little snug shirt. These leggings. I'm probably sure y'all seen these before. And then my um, viruses or whatever. So, nothing fancy. My hair is crazy. <sighs> I took my makeup off because I don't like to work out. Oh, y'all, let me tell y'all another thing. This is what I think helps me a lot when it comes to... Um, helps me a lot when it comes to, like, my face and all of that. Like, my face and stuff. Um, so, when I work out, I don't wear makeup. And if I'm, say if I'm, like, wearing makeup throughout the day and then I decide to work out. Hold on. So, anyway, yes. Yeah, so, what do I do with that water bottle? Oh. And say if, um, say if I decide to, um, yeah, wear makeup throughout the day and then I decide to work out. So, what I do is I normally just take my makeup off and I don't wash my face or nothing. I use baby wipes or something. Um, but I just use their baby wipes or you can use makeup remover pads, whatever you use. And I wipe my makeup off and then I don't put no lotion on it. Like nothing at all. Like so right now my pores are open. And then once I sweat, it's like it's kind of getting, especially for like it's getting everything out, I feel like. Um, even though my face feels a little dry, but I think it's kind of, I rather have, I rather not don't put lotion on. Um, when I work out on my face or something. Okay, um, yeah, so that's what I do. And then once I finish working out, I go ahead and do like a deep cleanse or, you know, just wash my face regularly. But that's what I do for real for my face. Um, I'm really tired. I've been up since like 8.45 this morning. Um, I wrote in my journal today, which is exciting. Um, I wrote them this morning, so they kind of helped me throughout the day. Um, this week's challenge, I don't even know if I told you guys, but this week's challenge is to control my thoughts, um, is to have control over my mind. Sometimes I think that we tend to allow things to interrupt um, our thoughts, 
things that we shouldn't even be worried about or shouldn't even be thinking about. Um, we have to prioritize, prioritize as we prioritize everything else in our life. We need to prioritize what sh what we should be thinking about, you know. And um, lately, you know, I've been I've been slacking and I've been focusing on, you know, things that I shouldn't be focusing on. So um, one of these techniques that my brother just taught me was to close my eyes and whatever I think about, if it's something that's not important, I continuously say it in my head like, so don't think about this, don't think about whatever the, whatever this is, I will say it. Don't think about it, don't think about it. Just keep saying it over and, and keep your eyes closed. Keep saying it over and over and over again until you open your eyes and you close your eyes again and then you ask yourself, what do you see? And I did that, you guys. And I don't see the same thing. So, and then I tend to not think about it like throughout the day. And I have a lot of exciting things coming, you guys. Um, one main thing that I'm really excited about that may open doors for more things. Um, I'm not going to share it until it's actually happening. Um, spring break is coming. Um, my spring break is March 2nd through March 10th, but we come back after that weekend. So I don't come back to school so far, really March 12th. Um, my mom's birthday is March 11th, guys. Hey, guys. Okay, so, um, I suppose I had went to a podcast, no, a live broadcast, which it was, but it wasn't what I expected. I thought that the speakers was going to be there, actually, like, physically talking. Sorry. So, therefore, like, I can ask questions and stuff like that if I needed to. But when I, when I walked in there, me and AB, when I walked in there, they was actually just showing it on the screen. So there wasn't really, like, people there. So I wanted, to, like, to be more of an interaction, personal interaction, rather than, like, a real life thing. So when I thought of, like, broadcast, I'm thinking, like, oh, they're going to record it and all of that stuff. But no, it wasn't like that. But you guys, I'm so tired. I look a mess. Like, I just pulled my hair back. It's fuzzy. It's, like whatever is raining out um but i'm about to go into ross because i need to see if i can find me another sports bra because the one i have is good but i work out a lot so like i try to i wash it every night like after i finish working out i wash it but it's like i'm tired of doing that so if i can have more than one to rotate with then i'd be okay so i'm about to go in here and um see if i can find me one but Y'all like my jacket though? It's like a crop top jacket. It's really cute. But let me go in here and see what, if I can find something. Excuse me. See if I can find something. Because I'm just ready to lay down, honestly. One thing about being natural, you don't have to like get an umbrella all the time. So I've been liking that. Day. So I just got back. Well, I don't even know how I put this robe on. Oh, because I didn't have no nothing um no clothes on and I just wanted to throw something on real quick. Just to let you guys know, I just came from the gym and, um, guys, look at my hair. This is like an old twist though. I'm about to slick my hair back. I really want my hair done. Like, I really want some weave, um, or some braids, but I really want some weave. Like, I've been dying for weave, but I've been holding off because your girl don't got no bundles money, okay? So, workout was bomb. It was bum. And I just ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Some slight. So, yeah. Guys and shine, beautiful people. It's Friday. No, I am about to head to the gym it's 8 15 i woke up at like 7 45 um it's cold it's cold it's cold i woke up at 8 45 um just 
you know, in a mood where I wanted to work out. And um, what well, I told myself last night to get up and actually go to the gym this morning. Instead of waiting to the evening to, you know, work out and stuff like that, I don't know, I might do it to a day. I mean, you know, I've done it before. It's not that bad. I was looking at last night for some good pre-workouts. If you guys work out and you have any suggestions, please let me know. Like, I want a pre-workout. Um, I want... Do I even have my ID cardio? Um... So, yeah, let me know if you guys, you know, work out and let me know if you use a pre-workout or whatever. I definitely want a protein shake because, like, I really don't eat meat that much. You know, it's kind of like I try to just eat a piece of chicken once a week. But, you know, even though I know I eat eggs sometimes in the morning, um, but I want to start eating egg whites. It's cold, freaking cold. Pre-workout shades to get me more motivated and energized and, you know. I have class at one. I also have an exam. So I am definitely gonna study over breakfast. And I heard that when you work out, it actually helps you to study. Oh, she has no jacket on. That's like, mm-mm. But, um, ooh, on my way back to my car, I jogged to the cafe to get some breakfast. I had uh, two pieces of wheat toast with light cream cheese. I had um, grits, two eggs, and fruit. I look a mess, so yes, but I am home. I came home last night and I just came home for the weekend. I rode with a friend so I didn't have to drive. So but I'm like I don't I don't have my car so I can't really go nowhere unless people pick me up. But yes. Yes, and I've been the boy. What is this on the floor? Cotton ball, hair ball. Yeah. So I don't know. So I could do a couple things today. I can go with my mom and them. Um, I am a part of the women's ministry at my church. And I don't know. I mean, I don't know if I feel like going to the meeting. I'm sure that, like, if I was home, of course, I'll go. But then, yeah. And then, like... We are um, giving my aunt a surprise home, uh, what is it, not a homecoming, housewoman, yes, a housewoman, so she don't know, so I don't know if I want to miss that, I don't know, I have to figure it out, but I can't show my hair and nothing, or above my eyes, because I'm looking ratchet, <laughs> but um, good morning guys, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Say bye, Benji. He knows when I like the camera.